Hello and welcome to our course. Let me introduce myself. I am Gabriela Collado. I have some experience as science teacher and now I work as pedagogical advisor at European Schoolnet. My colleague Alexa Joyce and I will be leading you through this course by introducing you to the different modules and course activities. Hello, I'm Alexa Joyce and I'm a senior manager here at European Schoolnet. I've been working on STEM education research projects for the last 14 years. Thank you very much to those of you who've completed the pre-course activities. If you haven't done so yet, you can find the links to the map and the survey here on this page. Let us tell you now how this course works. The course is organized in eight modules and it lasts eight weeks. So we'll be opening one module per week. Once open, the module will remain accessible for the duration of the course. Each module will open on a Monday. This means that you'll have access to all the materials related to a certain module from that Monday onwards. Then you'll have the rest of the week to complete the module. That is to say, to watch all video lectures, to carry out the activity, to take part in the forum, and if you wish to learn more, to consult the optional materials provided. A group of experts will be available to guide you through this course. Each week, you'll have videos to consult, usually two, and then the forum and activities to take part in. In weeks five, seven, and eight, we'll be organizing live sessions. In week five, it'll be a live virtual visit to some interesting research facilities. In week seven, we'll be having an online chat with a STEM professional. And in week eight, we'll be having an online chat with an expert in gender stereotypes in STEM. We'll keep you posted of the times and dates. Finally, at the end of each module, and after you've carried out the activity, there is a short quiz we'll ask you to complete in order to assess what you've learned. This is important if you wish to get the digital certificate at the end of the course. I would like to add that quizzes should be a straightforward task as they are intended to summarize the main ideas of each module. We hope you get a lot out of this course and enjoy the opportunity to reflect on your own STEM teaching and learning practice. We hope you'll enjoy the course. Bye for now.